Safe mode is a diagnostic mode, starts windows with a minimal set of drivers and system services, and allows you to isolate problems caused by third-party software or malfunctioning drivers. However, if you are stuck in safe mode, here is how to exit safe mode and return to normal operation on Windows 11 and Windows 10. The simple and quick way to exit safe mode is to restart your PC. This will usually boot your PC normally unless there is a problem with your system configuration or boot option. To restart your PC, click on the Start button, then select Power, Restart. If restarting your PC does not work, you may need to use the system configuration utility to change your boot options and turn off safe mode. First open the system configuration utility using msconfig command. Switch to the boot tab and uncheck the safe boot option. Next under the general tab, select normal startup. Click apply and then ok. Restart your computer when prompted to exit safe mode. Also, you can use the command prompt to edit the boot configuration data, BCD, and instruct your PC to turn off safe mode boot option. The BCD is a file that stores information about how Windows boots up, including whether it uses safe mode or not. Let's first, open the command prompt with administrator privileges. Type the command display on your screen and press enter key. Once the command has been executed successfully, close the command prompt and restart Windows. This should remove the safe boot option from the BCD and boot your PC normally.